Hey everyone and YouTube Lund. Um, just put up a short video here of some stuff on my bench and uh, what I'm up to. Um, today uh, it's a uh, you know it's uh, Sunday morning and it's Easter, so I figured take it some time to relax and enjoy the day. I think today's I think today's be a nice day to go for a drive or something like that. You know. <clears throat> Anyways, um, I just want to show you what's going on. So, um, bench is kind of dirty. Yeah, I'm working on some projects. Um, current project is um, I'm scratch building this uh, uh, excavator here. It's a uh, case uh, draw at 40. Um, it's a lot of work. To do it this way, but it's gonna be um, mounted on the back of this. Well, this is just a mock-up, but uh, it's gonna be on the back of the truck, like this. Um, I'll build a truck just like this one here. <clears throat> Very similar, but with dual rear axles and um, outriggers on the back and front stabilizers to make it a old uh, style of uh, truck and excavator uh, these weren't very common uh, and went to one scale uh, um, I guess uh, <clears throat> places got out of them um, got out of building that way because of uh, probably fuel costs and uh, generally the uh, hobby patrol don't like such a heavy duty apparatus on a truck like this so um, they stopped doing the, these kind of builds in real life. So, anyways, I'm bringing it that way. I've seen a picture just like it. Uh, so, that's how I'm building it. Um, there's a lot of work. Uh, the first time I ever, done, ever did something like this. But it's going to be, I'll be doing a lot more of it. Um, in the future, um, it just it's enjoyable doing stuff with this uh, scratch. I mean, you know, it's awesome. It's kind of a, a break from building cars all the time, cars and trucks. Kind of build some heavy duty equipment. So um, I get to build the boom still and add all the hydraulics and cylinders and build a bucket and. Um, I'm working on the interior slowly. I, uh, I don't know if you can see that too well in there. I've got a radio up top there. I've got my seat and I got my controls in. I got my foot controls in still, and um, the uh, control well, foot controls or uh, hand controls. I do that. Um, put a window in here still. I put windows in and that kind of thing. So it is a lot of work still, and they'll um, do an update video on this uh, build here uh, when I, uh, I get a chance. Other things I'm working on is this uh, uh, 1944, or excuse me, uh, early 60s um, Ford Econoline. Uh, it's not done yet. I have a lot of work to do on it still. To make it look proper, um, had a funny reaction happen to me with the paint. Um, uh, I used um, what the hell was it? Um, I used testers enamel paint on this, and I used testers um, enamel white. Then I started bleeding through, so I have to put a couple of coats on it, I guess. So. Um, it's coming along okay. So I need a lot of work doing it still. I'm putting a wood bed in here. Um, I have um, this has a wood grain on it. So I'm gonna paint a wood grain and stick it in here, like so. Make it like a wood box kind of thing that comes out like this. 
Yeah, I'm going to put uh, sides on it, uh, come up a bit, and maybe make it a plumber's truck or something like that. I'm not too sure yet. Um, here's a frame. Nothing special. I have quite a bit of work doing it still. So, um, there's a few things on it. Maybe put some side pipes or something on it. Uh, kind of cool. Yeah, so that's uh, that's what I'm working on. Um, you know, just scratch building parts and stuff that I need for these things. Um, but yeah. Anyways, you guys, um, stay tuned for more videos. Um, I'll put them up uh, when I get a chance. I don't always have a chance to uh, make videos all the time because I'm busy. Um, but uh, yeah, stay tuned for uh, more updates on this uh, build. So, bye for now and uh, chat with you guys soon.